In 2021, 40, 40, 44 percent of high school students reported that they persistently felt sad or hopeless, according to the CDC. And that is why CBS2 launched a series of special reports on breaking the stigma when it comes to children and mental health. The amount of people that go through like anxiety and depression is so much greater than the amount of people who don't. And that's something that I'm like learning just talking to people is like, wow, we're all struggling. So we're all at the end of the day, 16 year old kids in high school, you know, and I, I feel like that's just something that needs to get across. Does it help having the conversations knowing you're not alone? Yes, definitely. Our Jenna DeAngelis sat down with students at Cinema Riches High, Cinema Riches High on Long Island for an open conversation about mental health. The teens shared what they're coping with and how parents can help. And you can hear more from these students and other teenagers talking about the internal and external problems that they face in our half hour special, Breaking the Stigma, Children and Mental Health. Tune in right here tomorrow at 5.30 p.m.